He is just pulling the line out. Yep. He's pulled so much line out, man. I don't know how I would even gain any ground What's up, on guys? it. Jacob here, Whisker Whisper Fishing. We was actually, I already had an intro planned and I was uh, planning on fishing for hybrid using a method that I usually do, just a little shad and you know, Carolina rig set up and I felt like that's the best way to catch hybrid. I see a lot of uh, my fishing buddies catching a lot of hybrid right now this time of year, but for some odd reason, strangely enough, they were just catching them the other day and I get down here and I'm catching big catfish, flatheads, blues. I even caught a few drums, so I was using a bass rod and man, it was freaking exciting, crazy fights. You guys, I hope you enjoy the video and thanks for watching. So the fish we're hitting is right off of this wall. I haven't caught one yet, but that's a better one right there, yeah, man. It's a nice blue. Man, the thing's got belly on it. Hey, man. Finally got a fish on. Been throwing and throwing these little shad out there, and, I, and they're only hitting like right off the wall. The guy beside me over here is catching a bunch, mostly blue cats. And we're after hybrids, but catch anything at this point. Yeah, I got a pretty good one, I think. Hell yeah. Oh, blue cat. What do you got? Blue. There you go. Okay. <laughs> yep. <sighs> oh, yeah. Just gonna go ahead and take the hook out while I'm down here and release him back. But it's my first fish, blue cat on the Mojo Bass. Thanks, brother. If he can get out of the rocks. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, he hit it hard. This one's bigger than the first one. Feels that way, anyhow. He feels bigger than the first one, that's for sure. Oh, yeah, it looks like he's bigger than the first one. Looks like a good one. He hit her hard. I think so. Pulling line out. Take a line? Yeah. I didn't know they it for you. All right, that works. I might be on him for a minute, but yeah. That's a good one. You got a good one. Does it? I'm gonna guess go out on a limb here and say it's a blue cat because it rolls. Why that thing hit it? Fighting catfish on a bass pole. I guarantee that's what this is. If it's a hybrid, it's a hoss. This thing's got some weight to it. He's got some weight to him, yeah. I'm afraid he's gonna come all the way in, take a run, and. Yeah, he's gonna take a dive. Usually they get that far and run off the dive. 
I'd say that's what he's probably going to do on me. He's down there a little bit still yet. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. He's big, I saw him. I did too. I did. He, he'll be about 20 pounds. He's close to it if he ain't. That's the damn sure. That current right there feels about 100. <laughs> you ain't a kidding. <laughs> That's a good one. He's a good one. He's a good one. <coughs> got room and water in my mouth. <laughs> All right, guys, there you go. Uh, really aggressive blue cat, kind of tearing both of us up here and uh, biting really freaking hard. And, uh, ah! <laughs> really chopping me, man. But we're going to get him back in the water. We're using some, uh, there's a little shad actually, and the blue cat are hitting pretty hard. So we're going to get him back out there and try to catch some more of them. So this is the combo I'm using right now. This is just a little uh, cheapo bait caster and uh, mojo bass rod. Uh, medium power seven seven footer so you see what I'm uh, what I'm catching these blues on that was probably close to a 15 20 pound blue I would say every bit of it we'll only bring the scale out if they look like they really need it where did you get your cat at right here just right here is that where you got yours? No, I got mine. I know where that is. Oh, dude. There's a bunch of them running right there. You throw one time, you catch them. I couldn't get down there yesterday, and I didn't see them today. That's why I went down there. Got it. Oh, yeah. You yeah, I got it. No, nah, he didn't feel as big. He felt like a. He felt. He feels really small, actually. He feels like a channel. He's running in with me. Yeah. Here. And if you guys don't know, I'm right-handed as all get out. It's a left-handed reel. So uh, I'm feeling it. And that's a drum. Drum. Yeah, big drum. Yeah. Hey, oh, sheep head. Go. My net, well, you got a better net than I do. I just got a little three footer. That's all that one is, too. Oh, I'm sure there is. It's just hard not to lose your net. There it is. Oh, there it is. Man, got that's him. Shit hard. Yeah. He hit it right whenever I was about to show you where I was throwing at. That might be a 
I'm gonna say a drum again, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, unless it's, it could be a channel cat, but that's how that drum felt. This one feels a little bigger, but. It's a fish. It's a fish. <laughs> I'll be down there. Yeah. Channel cat. Channel. Got him. Yeah. If he breaks when I pull him up, the line was weak. <laughs> We're catching all kinds of different species of fish today. This right here we got us a channel. Good. Put him back, see if we can catch a blue cat or something else. Yeah. Oh my Did he hit it after that other one? I don't think I had a snag. Really? I'm telling you now, this is the biggest. This is the biggest. <laughs> this is the biggest. Oh, dude. I thought I had a snack. Oh, I got a fish too. There we go. Oh. I think you're, you want to switch poles? Dude, I thought I was flat. Now I said there was one, I'll let it click because you're getting more on the hand. That's a good one. Hey, this one got off or something. Oh, no, he's still in there. Oh, man. He hit hard, but he ain't fighting. This is a weird acting oh, fish right here. <laughs> He's been caught before. Look right there on the side. That's not for me. You need help with that? Two, three. Gotcha. Got him? Yep. That's a nice one. He's good. Oh shoot, I'm going towards that roller. Can you hold this thing? I'm going towards the bag on roller. I'm going to cross all their lines. Got him. Yeah, he's on there. Feels like a pretty good one, too. Feels like a pretty good one. Oh, he's a really good one. He's pulling all kinds of line out. He's pulling all kinds of line out on the... Yep. Yeah. And he's way out there. Oh. That's how I like to end it, though. Yep, yeah, there you go. <laughs> it's going to be a minute, I think. I'm going to close a little bit. He feels like a flathead, man. But I keep guessing and I'm keep wrong, keep being wrong, so I'm not gonna say he's a flathead, but he's starting to get up to close to the surface, so I wouldn't be surprised if he kicked it on here in a second. Because he is pretty heavy. He's really heavy actually. Oh man. And he's swimming against current that strong, man. He's pulling me against the current and he feels that strong. So this is a good fish, really good fish. He is just pulling the line out. Yep. He's pulled so much line out, man, I don't know. 
how I would even gain any ground on him. And he's still just pulling line out. Yeah. He's getting tired. Yeah. Oh, Bob. <laughs> Big fish. He's bringing bubbles with him. That's a flatty. Yeah. He's a a good flatty. Maybe 10. I'll check the weight on him. I can't believe I called one right. Let's check the weight on him. Get a guess about what he weighs. What do you think he weighs, buddy? Uh -huh. 12. Let's check real quick. I'm going to one up you and say 13, 14. We's both pretty close, about 13, 14 pounds. Is that right? Yep. Yeah. So we both pretty close. I'm gonna hold him up with you. Yeah. We're gonna turn him back in the water and I'm gonna call it quits. I've had a great day. These fish are just gorgeous. He had a long fight. Go on, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> 